make one of my favorite side dishes that I make every now and then. I'm going to cut this cauliflower up. leaves and I just start breaking it up. Now that piece is pretty large so I'll cut that in half. Just break them up. Cut them up and putting this in the saucepan or the pot. Just as big or as small as you want. So I put water here in my pot. I'm going to turn the heat on and let this come to a boil. Well, when I saw my water starting to bubble, I set a timer for 15 minutes. Now it's been 17 minutes. I'm just testing to see if it's tender. I can get a fork through it. And it's nice and tender. I'm going to take it to the uh, sink and drain the water off. Well, I've drained the water off and it's still in my pot here. I'm going to add some mayonnaise. Maybe about a third of a cup. And a third of a cup of sour cream. Maybe half a cup. I'm also going to add curry powder. It's four teaspoons. I'm going to add salt. It's half a, or one teaspoon of kosher salt. Add a half a teaspoon of white pepper. Half a teaspoon of turmeric. I'm going to mix. I'm going to add just a little bit more of mayonnaise. Mix that a half a cup of mayonnaise. And what I do is lots of time I'll put a lid on this, put it back on the warm burner on the warm stove, and I'll eat it just like this. But since you're watching, uh, we can make a casserole out of it. I'm going to take my glass baking dish, spray it with cooking spray, or you could use butter. Oh wait, I forgot an ingredient. I apologize, I forgot something. Some cheddar cheese. We'll mix this in. And then I put this back on my warm stove with the lid on it and then have it as a side dish. How could I forget that? Okay, but we're going to make a casserole out of it. Let's make sure it's mixed up well. Spread it into there. Next, we're going to make a topping for our cauliflower casserole. Can you guess what these are? These are Cheetos. Cheetos are a favorite snack of mine. I'm going to add, it's probably about two and a half or three cups of them in there if you were to put them in a cup and um, try and measure them. Put in four tablespoons of butter. We're going to mix these up and put these on our casserole. Spread them out. I'm 
I hope you like cauliflower. If you don't, you'll like it now. Let me assure you. This goes in my 350 degree oven. Here it is out of the oven. I baked it for 20 minutes. I'll just get a little bit of it here. And let me assure you, this stuff is excellent. Just excellent. It smells so good with all that curry powder in there. Hopefully a new favorite for your family. Thanks so much for watching.